entertainment industry in Kenya is asleep. Uh, artists have become predictable, redundant, and boring. And that is a good space for you to take over. Uh, most, if not all, artists are no longer as creative. Uh, we are living in the dark ages of Kenyan mus music. Tanzania wana to pig na Nigeria. Nigerians are here every weekend. And Kenyan musicians have become curtain raisers. Wana lipwa 30k, okay, and the backstage wana skumwa. It is a disgrace. The industry is a disgrace. And I'm, I'm speaking to all the artists that we need to to to, to wake up. Na tuwache kufanya bitu, araka raka, alahala, watuka adamu wa situngarie. We have become clowns in our own country. The Tana was here, Sujui, Omale, Sujui who? It is not, we are not blaming any corporate, I'm blaming the artist. We need to wake up and put in the work. Eric Omondi puts in the work. I'm the only artist who pats myself on the back. There is no artist that works as hard as Eric Omondi, and you know it. So we need to call upon musicians to wake up, entertainers to wake up. We, we are a cemetery, bro. We are a cemetery. Our glory is gone. Hakuna muzichata moja na tia hapa kena. And it's not personal. If I'm going to call myself the president of comedy or entertainment, then that is my work to tell the entertainment industry that you are kaburi, bro. You are, it's dead and buried. It's embarrassing. And ask yourself why there are no more Kenyan concerts. Every poster has Jalango, Rikomondi, Fredomondi, Ngamwai. Jalango, Fredomondi, Rikomondi, Ngamwai. Where's Willie Paul? I see calligraph. I don't know where Saudi Soul is. I spoke to Biena Kanyambia, plan yao. I pray to God. It's a very good plan. Pray to God. When you gabu na frasha wali toka, where I can amaza, jokali ya maza kidogo. Bro, I'm begging the entertainment industry to bring back our pride. And it's the easiest thing to do. It's just to wake up and to be current and to be creative.